So the problem is uh, a W shape, 14 by 74. Di na siya 836, no? A992 still has a length of 6 meters and pin at N. So K niya will be equal to 1, pin at both sides. The question is compute the design compressive strength for LRFT and allowable compressive strength ASD. So, dalawa. Also, check for the global and local stability. Okay, so let's begin. So, paano ba uumpisahan? Katulad din ng fourth edition, and let's begin with KL over R. Okay? So, yung K L over R. Diretso tayo sa RY. Kasi, since they have the same length for both axes or axis, X and Y, so, ang mag-govern ng uh, tawag dito, slenderness ratio will be yung, yung the weaker axis. So, that will be K will be 1. Ang length is ayan, 6 meters. So, that will be 6,000 millimeters. Millimeters, kinonvert na. Divided by 62.99 millimeter. So, ang sagot niya, if I'm not mistaken, is 95.25. So, check natin. No? 6,000 divided by 62.99 and 95.25. Okay, now, instead of, ano, yung co-compare co natin sa C sub C, we will compare this with 4.71. Ito ngayon yung C sub C niya, ano, or, ang tawag dito, column constant. E over FY. Ang FY na ito, ang E is 200,000, no? Kapisado na natin yan. Ang F sub Y niya, since A992, hindi 248. Pag A992, Ang FY niyan is 345. You should memorize this by heart. And the answer is 113.4. Okay, so since uh, this is the case, slenderness ratio is less than the column constant, which is this one is 4.71. Then ang gagamitin nating equation yung this one. So use critical buckling stress, FCR equal to 0. 0.658 times this one huh? or raised to fy over f sub e times f sub y okay also dapat kapisado nyo na f sub e Euler stress uh, ang equation nyan is pi squared e over kl over r no yung nag-govern ano. So, I think KL over R in 95.25. So, it's pi squared. Again, a modulus of elasticity of steel is 200,000 megapascal divided by 95.25 and the answer is how much? That is 217. So, gawin natin ang number. 217. 57 megapascal. Okay. Also, kung nire-recall nyo yung lecture, dapat i-compare ko yan doon sa uh, what do you call this? FY over F sub E. So, ang FY is ilan? Uh, 345, di ba? Divided by the computed value na 217.57 ang sagot niyan is 1.59 which is less than 2.25 so ang gagamitin natin is 1.59 if nag-exceed itong value sa 2.25 ang gagamitin mong FY over FE para dito para dito is 2.25 since di siya nag-exceed you will use yung 1.59 Okay, so, makuha na natin kaagad yung madali, ha? Critical buckling stress, which is equal to what? Uh, 0.658 raised to 1.59 multiplied by okay, using lang natin para mandaganda naman ng konti, times 345 Anong critical buckling stress na ngayon? 
So, kung bitin, and the answer is 177.34 megapascal. Okay, so, ano ngayon yung PN? Nominal. It's FCR times AG. Diba? This, the force is equal to stress times the area. So, ano bang AG niya? Dito. 14,064. So, it's 177.34 times 14,064. So, ilan? Kapitin ko lang saglit. So, the answer is divided pa natin ng, ng 1,000 squared. Lang. And the answer is 2,000. Tama ba? Let's see. Ah. So, megapascal. Ah, tama. Newton per millimeter squared. Times, oh, tama. Divide mo lang ng 1,000. So, the answer is 2,494.11 kilo newton. Para hindi na siya newton lang. Okay? So, that is the answer. Pero hindi pa tayo tapos. Yan yung answer for global. Okay? Global. Ito sa global. So, so check natin yung local buckling. Pero, since diniscuss ko na nga, wala tayong, almost wala tayong problema sa local buckling kapag pinag-uusapan natin ay uh, W shape. So, let me just prove it to you, no? So, pag low pa, check natin, it should not exceed with, ano, no? Conditions of BF over 2 TF. Ikaw, compare mo lang sa point 56 square root of P over FY. So, ano yung BF? Given na, given na yan, 255.78. So, same lang natin. So, 255.78 divide mo lang ng thickness ng plunge din, ilan? check lang natin ulit, 19.94 ilan? so, pakicompute and the answer is 6.41 i-compare mo to dito 200,000 divided by 345 this is 13.48 so, okay siya, no? No problem sa local stability pagdating sa plunge. How about sa web? Ang web is H over TW. Ang H, given yung depth, tinan natin dito. Saan na yun? Ah, hindi, D. 359.92. Imo minus natin 2 times K. Okay. So, in 2K, given... 39.69 divided by the thickness of the web ay 11.43 the answer is 24.54 and may confident ako na hindi lalampas kasi nga sinabi sa lecture na hindi siya lalampas o tama, this is 35.54 87. So, okay. So, pag ganyan, no problem for local buckling. Okay. Sir, papano kung lumampas? Well, just like I've said, hindi nga siya lalampas. Pero, sige, pakita ko sa inyo, no? Ngayon, teka, bago yun, pag hindi siya lumampas, so, parehas pa rin sila. Ang, ang, ang P sub N niyan will be the same for global, which is equal to 2,000. Ilan yun? 1,000? 494.11. Okay. So, the same yung capacity kasi wala kang problema sa local buckling. So, yan pa rin ang uh, nominal axial force. But the question is, 
uh, what is the LRFD? So, ano nga yung LRFD? Diba? So, simple lang. So, LRFD, magpasan ko lang ng konti. So, for L, RFD, bali PU, will be equal to 0 0.9, times 2494.11 sa ASD it's P sub A equal to 2494.24 medyo mas mabilis ako magsalita kaysa magsulat 2494.11 divided by 1.67 so that R your, that is by your final answer. So, kumpitin lang natin, 0.9 times 2494.11 Pares pa tayo na sagot? So, 2, 244.70 kN Ito naman pag ano uh, uh, pag that AST and the answer is, syempre mas maliit to 1493.11 so ito yung sagot sa tanong kung bakit siya ganyan okay wala nang hihigit dyan kasi yan na yung final answer okay o, balik tayo dito sa ano paano kung nagkaroon ng problema sa local coupling well sinasabi ko na nga pagdating sa W shape walang problema dyan Pero since tinanong nyo, isabutin natin, ito yun, okay? Yan. Ito yung lecture ko nung nakaraan, hindi ko lang pinakita. If it uh, talagang lumampas, wala kang magawa, no? Pabasahin lang natin. Ito yun. The reduction factor, or hindi, dito na lang. Many of the shape commonly used as a column are not slender. Or meaning, wala kang problema sa local stability, okay, or local buckling, the reduction factor will not be needed. So, balik na rin natin, kapag may problema sa local stability or local buckling, magkakaroon ka lang ng reduction factor. Okay? So, most, editing ko lang, the most of the shape commonly used for column are not slender. So, W shape, this include most but not all W shape. Okay, most but not all W shape. So, nung pinakita ko sa inyo to, eto, actually, chinek ko yan, Ewan ko, no? pero hindi siya lumampas. Uh, wala siyang problema sa local buckling. Pag ginamitan natin ito, wala. Okay, so chinek ko na. If you want, you can check it by yourself. no? So kapag nagkaroon ng issue, magkakaroon ka lang ng yung, uh, reduction factor na Q. Ito, yung Q. Okay? Uh, I will not go into detail any longer for this kasi nga, focus natin sa undergrad is just the W shape. Okay, so thank you so much. I hope you learn, uh, especially preparation to sa board exam for sa mga graduate ngayon, no? Sa November. I hope you you study this and makatulong. Kung talagang ang pangako nila, 6 edition ang lalabas, then this would be a great help. Thank you so much.